Hey, you got anything to do today? Got a thousand bucks with the packs. Monopoly money. 2324. Upper deck SPX hockey. We're gonna see what we can get from a thousand dollars worth of packs of SPX. So there's that. But before we get into today's video, this video is sponsored by Mirage Training. Looking for a sealed box yourself? Check out MirageTraining.com. Featuring old and new boxes ranging from hockey to TCGs. Be sure to check out the newly released SPX. Also, be sure to check out Mirage Breaks and watch Mirage's live stream on Whatnot on YouTube Friday and Saturday. Follow them on Whatnot and bookmark their shows to be notified when they are live. Canadians can join their breaks from Mirage Breaks website and earn points which can be redeemed for discounts. Also, be sure to check out Mirage app. A very useful, handy way to shop. Featuring tab for in-stock boxes, pre-orders, and much, much more. So be sure to check out the app. Also, be sure to check out Settle to buy now and pay later to make purchasing those big ticket items easier. Thank you much for sponsoring today's video. All these in the description. Let's get into today's video. All right, thousand bucks for the pack. 2324 SPX. This one's pretty straightforward. There's only one pack in a box and the average cost of a box is 230 to 250 Canadian. And at the high end times 250 by four, you get a thousand bucks. Granted, if you do the low end at 230, it will come in under a thousand, but it's only a single pack box. So if you add another box, you'll be way over. So for this, we're opening four packs, 2324 SPX. And we're going to hope we can get some better results in release day. Also, one of these packs does not feel like the other. It's a super thick pack. Pack. Also, after effect, it looks like Summer Bedard's autographs are redemptions in here, which actually blows. His lustrous rookie out of 99 isn't a redemption, but his gold of 25 is. And his patch out of 75, and I'm guessing the clarity as well is a redemption. There's one right here for 3200 bucks with bids. And his pride of a nation is a redemption, so that is really rough. That's concerning for future procs as well, so okay. So let's get right into it. Ziri, for whatever reason, my audio violently passed away for this first box. So we'll do a voice over here for the first one. First card on the pack, we have a Nikita Nesterenko Purple Parallax to 149. So there's the first card. So yeah, my audio just completely sharded itself. So here's a voiceover. Next card up here looks like we have a, a Radiance FX. Yeah, 949 Riker Evans. Hopefully I'll have some comps on these. I'm just in the process of editing this video right now. I had to redo the entire intro and everything. That was fun. But next card up here, we have a, what are these? Fine, oh, there's that guy. Connor Bedard, finite rookies is 799, 21 to 799 for Connor Bedard. I was saying that it's pretty hard to get a Bedard in his proc. You can open cases without putting Bedard, so it's nice to see Bedard in there. Next card up, we have oh another one of these radiant. It's a gold to 99. Oh my gosh, Zach Benson. So that's actually a pretty good gold. This box has been pretty darn good. So there's a Radiance FX gold, I believe. It's a spectrum to 99 of Zach Benson. So a good pull there. Next card up, the hit of the box, the autograph. It's a rookies. It's a base rookies. It is John Beecher. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. John Beecher, base rookie autograph. So first box, not too bad whatsoever. Of course, sticker autograph there. We're looking for the on-card stuff. It's going to be like the UD Black stuff. So yeah, there you go. There's the first box. So yeah, 20 tool cards for $1,000. All right, second pack up here. I got to grab the filler. It's easier for me just to have my eyes closed and then slide it in there. All right, pack number two. Looks like we have another purple in the back there. Matthew Kachuk, 122, 149. Another parallax purple. I don't even know if we've gotten a true base of 299 yet, but let's continue on here. Next up, we have... Ivan Roshnichenko, Radius FX 620 of 949. I don't know why the packs are backwards this year, but K. Okay. Then we have another, oh geez. Oh, hold on. We have a Finite Rookies, Michael Kesselring, 13 of 799. And these are fairly tough here, so let's just reveal it there. Oh, to 30. That's probably going to be our box hit. SBX Force, Owen Power, Rasmus Dellin, Dylan Cousins, Tage Thompson. These are a thing in basketball. So we got the Buffalo Sabres there. Pretty much their core moving forward right there. So that one's the 30, 21 of 30. Cool. And we have one more card here. Looks like it's. Uh, Adam Jinning. <laughs> we actually have a rookie jersey auto. So there you go. Adam Jinning. Three of 375. So we actually did get a rookie jersey out of Adam Jinning though. So not the best of names for sure for the Swedish defenseman there. But sign a piece of paper with a player worn jersey there, right? Yeah, been worn by the featured players. So there you go. Adam Jinning. SBX rookie jersey auto. 375 to finish off. Pack two. All right, let's do pack three. I mean, that thick card could be anything. There's a lot of things it could be. It might not be a patch card. Might not be a patch autograph. Let's see what we have for pack three. Thousand dollars worth of packs. And we have another purple yeah we have another purple mother's reveal here hey card verhege 104 of 149 there for verhege so another panther in the parallax purple that took me way too long to get out of my mouth but k okay. next up we have another one of these radiance it is oh matthew nice 949 though 871 949 radiance fx matthew nice then we have another zach benson card another finite rookies that is 201 of 799 for zach benson just a basic finite rookie there and we're down to two cards here we have a black jersey or just a black rookie, Obsidian rookies. 23 of 199 for Levy Marilinen. Decent looking one there. So Levy Marilinen, Obsidian rookie. K. And the final card. I'm just gonna. I see the helmet there. So I don't know if it's a rookie jersey auto, but there's definitely a helmet there. It's 
One of the Columbus Blue Jackets rookies. Oh, it's Fozel. That's a sticker auto. Superscripts, okay. Then it's last Fozel. Rookie Superscripts autograph. Not the worst for sure. The autograph isn't the best there. It's like an S and then another S maybe. No. There you go. Stanislas Fozel. Rookie Superscripts. So and let's continue on here. We got one more pack and it's a beefy one. So that's pretty much our only hope right now. So okay. I'm starting to think that release date break was actually indicative of the product. I'm very concerned here. Let's just check to make sure. Okay, well that might not be anything. Granted, like some of the UD black cards used to be super thick in the past. Looks like those aren't, so could be a UD black rookie patch auto, which would be nice. Okay, here we go, and it's not the last card, it's the second last card. Might be a massive troll job here, but first card up we got Darcy Kemper. That's a blue one to 100, now part of the LA Kings. That's a Radiance, so there's my first Radiance I believe I pulled, so okay. Next card up here, we have another one of these Radiance here. Yuri Patera, which is kind of confusing considering that peril is called Radiance, this is Radiance FX, so Patera, 949K, two for two on the goalies, and we have a Finite Rookies, Heisen Forster, 23 of 799 for Forster there, just a basic Finite Rookies, haven't got a single parallel these, and we're down to the final two cards, that second card has to be something, right, uh, we got trolled, oh, okay, well, is it a patch at least, yeah, it's a patch, all right, Quentin Byfield, still underwhelming as heck, 7 of 25, Obsidian Patch, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, well, there you go. Game use piece for Byfield there. City and patch. Has some silver in there, which is neat, but fairly underwhelming considering I know that that's a decent pull, so they're going to throw some hot manure. Matt Murray. Yeah. Okay, don't buy his product. Oh my gosh, I just threw away, what, 1500 bucks? Like, just flushed it down the toilet. That was horrendous. This has to be one of the worst products. This and Black Diamond are like the worst product there is around. The price point does not make any sense. I know 21 22 is down to under $100 Canadian and like 70 bucks US. Like, it's totally worth that, that price point, but yeah, this is brutal. Absolutely brutal. I actually feel like I just got completely ripped off. What? <laughs> Terrible product. I should stop doing this for most releases. And you know what? I was thinking, yeah, you probably shouldn't do it for this one because you know you're going to get destroyed here. So, 1000 bucks worth of packs. That was horrible. That has to be one of the worst $1,000 worth of pack pricks I've ever done. So we got four base, all of them which are parallels. They didn't get a true base. There's Parallax. We got three of them. Nestoranko rookie Verhegi Kachuk. We also got a Radiance Blue there of Camper. We got five Radiance FX, some of which being rookies. We got the Matthew Nyes. We got Yuri Patera, Riker Evans, Ivan Moroshnachenko, and Zach Benz. They're actually all rookies there. Benson's like the Golden 99. We got some final rookies. Zach Benz. Tyson Forster, Michael Kesselring. These are all the 799. We got a Marilina Obsidian Rookies of 199. Then we get this SPX Force 21 of 30. Buffalo Sabres there. Now, before we get on the hits, Bedard check. We got one Bedard. The Finite Rookies of 799. Probably your best pull, which is shocking, but okay. In terms of hits, I'm laughing here because we only got one memorabilia on top of the autographs there. So, we got Obsidian Patch right there. Quentin Byfield 25. That's decent, but still nothing special. Now, autographs are a complete joke. I'm Jenning 375. That's the rookie jersey autograph there. Got the Svolza Rookie Super Script. Another rookie superscripts of Matt Murray and a base rookie autograph, John Beecher. So all in all, that was brutal. I'm sad now. Yeah, guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. Probably not any SPX. There's always things you're watching. I'll see you guys later.